Okay, headed into Target. I'm on a couple missions right now. I'm actually looking for a couple outfit favorites, but a lot of beauty favorites too. So I think I'm gonna do like a little haul with you guys, some affordable Target favorites when I get back in. And also what I've been using in my hair, I think it's from Target. So I'll make sure I put that down below too, but let's go see what they have in Target. I also feel like I may get sucked into the fall Target decor vortex, so. Found these for Kins, literally so cute. I think she actually needs a 13, so I'm gonna see if they have smaller, but like little Birkenstocks, love. Grabbing this in the small size, I have the really big size and it honestly smells so good, I love it. So I'm gonna try the little size just because I have a lot of travel coming up. The e.l.f. liquid or halo glow liquid filter is so good. It honestly is very similar to the Charlotte Tilbury, but this is definitely, my target only has like the deeper shades. I think I have shade four so much about that concealer you have it's really good or i've heard about the camo concealer, yeah the camo actually. one the camo concealer is very good it reminds me a lot of the tarte shape tape i probably prefer tarte a little bit honestly but very similar this concealer is so underrated you guys i've used this forever i got my mom hooked on this too it's amazing this little on the go thing from Revlon is so cool if you're traveling because you don't have to like add a bunch of extra powder. You literally roll it across your face and it takes the oil away. It's pretty crazy. Wait, what's this? Do they have like, oh, oh, oh no. I think it's ball, ball replacement. <laughs> extra balls, never know. That is not Barry. I got excited by that name, Barry and more, but that is not Barry. I am excited about Dolce Pink. I want to try that one. It's a fuzz. I think this looks really pretty. I'm gonna try Sugar Plum. I've never tried this color, but it could be hit or miss. I'll try it when I get home. An OG favorite. Let's bring this mascara back, honestly. I feel like this one was so nice. Green is kind of fun. I've never used a could green that be fun? I wore, I wore oh, they in that color <gasps> too. Wow. Ooh, the purple? Oh, Deep yeah. burgundy. Hell yeah. That's gonna be cool. This is one of my favorite hair products, the defining cream. I really like the gel too. I don't think they have that one, but this one I really like. I wonder what like bodybuilding um, dry shampoo is. An orange mango honestly sounds so good. Hair, 10 hair in one, oh, 10 in one, hair perfector. It's aggressive. This could be good. It's for like frizz and everything too. I might try this, honestly. Okay, this is an Audrey Rec. She said that it helps make her hair like less frizzy um, when you air dry. So since I typically do a curl product, I might try this when I want something like a little bit softer when I don't want to feel like I have anything in my hair. Or maybe I'll mix this and the curl product, TBD. I don't think anyone can avoid Honestly, the fall. Like, look at this. This is so cute. Does it smell good? Oh, I love pumpkin vanilla, yes. I have to get this. I'm having a basic moment and I'm not mad about it, but this vanilla pumpkin candle in Target right now is honestly everything. Wait, this is so oh funny. Gosh. That does not be a TikTok crunch. Ooh, trick. Cinnamon Toast Crunch would probably be... Lucky Charms was my vibe. Lucky Charms? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Little under a candle holder. This thing, which, surprise, surprise, I don't know what I'm gonna do with, but I do think it's really pretty in the colors you need. So, excited for that and got some clothes for Kins. It's a wrap. Back from Target, I'm gonna show you guys what I got, I'm actually really excited. And then the other day when I was at the beach with my family, I forgot literally any and all powder products. That's how infrequently I've been using them. I completely forgot to pack any of them, but it was so hot, like humid and sticky in Florida that I wanted to set some creams and ended up grabbing a couple things from the drugstore there too. So I'll show you guys what I got. So, um, okay, Target first up, I got the black carbon or carbon black voluminous by L'Oreal, if you know, you know, classic, forever. And then I also found it in this really pretty, like deep burgundy, which I think is so pretty. So I'm super excited to try that for fall. I got Milani in 01 Dolce Pink, which also looks really nice. And then I got another re-up on a concealer. This is probably my favorite drugstore concealer, minus e.l.f. I think e.l.f. is really good too, which I also got. Um, but I got Maybelline Age Rewinder or Age Rewind Eraser. 
this is in shade 120. I honestly, it doesn't say like medium or anything on it. So I really don't know this color is going to work, but I do know that I like this concealer. And then I got another one of my e.l.f. camo concealers. This one's very similar to Tarte. I do prefer Tarte a little bit, but if you are a babe on a budget, highly recommend this one. Um, 16 hour camo concealer. Now let's talk about the Ariana Grande perfume. I've been wearing this one a lot. I love it. Look how cute the packaging is, but I have the big one of her cloud perfume and I've been traveling a lot lately. And so I love these little ones to travel with. And I think it's such a nice perfume. Love that Target find. I also got this because it looks like it could be really pretty. It is L'Oreal Color Rouge and Sugar Plum. Let's open it and swatch it together. Y'all have an itch like underneath my eye right now. It's driving me crazy. Okay. Oh, two layers of stickers. <laughs> okay. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get Can I just test it? Okay. Cool. Is she metallic? This could be an oversight. Oh, you know. Ooh, pretty. Really pretty. Nude. It's lighter than I thought it was going to be, but the tone is nice on these. All right, and then, oh, I got this. Audrey recommended this. She really likes it. She said when she air dries her hair. Um, and it is Weightless Shine Air Dry Creme Cream for all hair types, frizz, calming, shine restoring, softening and smoothing, which sounds really good. And Audrey's hair always looks soft and smooth with no frizz. So I'm gonna give that a go. And then I'm super into Not Your Mother's right now. So I got the All Eyes On Me 10 in 1 Perfector from Not Your Mother's. I got a little deodorant, aluminum free deo for the BO baby. And then, okay, this is a little haul that I got in Florida, which is like really random, but I needed this stuff. So I got this little like highlighter combo. This is um, Hello Halo Blush Lighter. Cool, wet and wild, thanks so much. Very pigmented, honestly, oops. Oh, like honestly, that's crazy. I got the bronzer, not quite as pigmented. I would say did the trick like in the moment, but I needed something darker. If you're lighter than me, I think you might like this though. Wet n Wild Color Icon Bronzer in the shade Sunset Striptease, which did not happen on the family vacation. And then I got a Maybelline Fit Me in 55. Berry, really pretty. I think it looks nice with this kind of fall lip. Okay, other random shit from Target that I wanted to show you guys. This candle, if you can get it, it's like pretty big, but I love it. It's vanilla pumpkin and it's like a three wick. And I think that the, oh, it smells so good. It smells like fall. But I think that the like little container is also so pretty because it kind of just acts as decor. And it was 20 bucks, which I feel like for a candle this big is nice. Like this is a normal candle size. I don't know how I can show you guys like it's a big candle. So yeah, and then they had these which I got the little Libra and Aries on there these little like um, Horoscope ones I got the Libra which is the ruling planet Venus or the ruling planet of Libra is Venus leafy greens and cardamom Yum, and then I got Aries blood orange and peach Also, yeah, I thought these were very aesthetic and cute. I got this little like tray thing for a candle, love that for the kitchen or the bathroom. And then I got this vase, which I think could potentially be really pretty either in the kitchen on this table, which is where I have you guys resting right now, or in my living room, like in one of the shelves for fall. So that's my little target haul. I'm officially ready for colder weather. We went to Dunkin' today and got a really bomb drink. I'll put that in the description. Um, another Audrey wreck and it was chef's kiss, so good. So that's it, I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you, bye.